eighth grade. I think that's all of us. Thank you guys for coming in. I hope you had fun out at field day. You earned it. And we're all proud of you. Uh, all of you in here at this point are eighth graders. Um, most of you, the majority of you, have been here since sixth grade. So it's so gratifying to see where you came in and now where you are and where you will be by the end of the school year, okay? Um, we begin with the end of mind in mind here at Rowlett Middle. And it's so awesome to see that continuous growth. But we're not done yet. We want you to start dreaming. Just think about it. You'll be in high school in just a few months. So we want you to really understand the magnitude of every decision, every academic decision, but also every behavioral choice that you make inside of school and outside of school. You may think that they don't matter, but all these things matter. Every choice is going to contribute to what class you get in high school, maybe what high school you go to. And it keeps going on and on because in high school, once you get there, all of those assignments, all of those choices, all of those clubs you decide to join, or sports teams, or activities, or the amount you volunteer, all of those things will contribute to your opportunity to go to college. So what I'm saying is, start now. Put first things first, set goals for yourself, and continue to move forward towards them. Okay? So we're proud of all the students who met uh, 3.5 and up, but we're proud of this collective group as well. And if you did not get the opportunity to, in first quarter, reach that 3.5 and up, you are now being challenged. Because the people who met that threshold of 3.5, you guys have heard me say before, it's not like they're just smart and they don't have to put forth any effort to achieve that goal. They're working hard too. They're coming to tutoring too. Not only people who have D's and F's go to tutoring. You're, you're, you're mistaken. So we're providing a lot of resources for you because we know it takes not only a village to help you guys be successful, it takes, you know, you're working hard, talking to your teachers, making good choices, using those seven habits, all of these are tools in your tool belt that will help you be successful in the future, okay? So we started the year with three simple goals. Rowlett, Rowlett Middle Culture, Rowlett Culture, Clear Expectations, and Excellence in Arts and Academics. Our culture is that positive environment, making good choices, knowing that we all have value, making sure we're having fun and rewarding you for making good choices and academic excellence. So we try to balance that on our campus. All right, so that is the, the, the positive culture we have. Expectations, we want to have clear expectations for you. Academically in the classroom, you know exactly what your teachers expect from you. You know exactly how to turn in your assignments on Google Classroom by eighth grade. You know exactly the extra support you can get when you need help. You know your teachers are there for you. All right, those academic expectations are there. Also, you know what our behavior expectations are. We know we keep our hands, feet, negative comments to ourselves. We know there are no threats, no vapes, no bullying, right? If you don't have anything nice to say, don't say it at all. We know those things. We know those expectations. Uh, but you have to apply them now that you know. You can't say that you don't know at this point in your career at Rowlett Middle. Okay? So these are all personal choices that you're making. We just want you to, you know, make sure your, your, your choices are aligned with your goals and where you see yourself at the end of the year and in high school and in the future, okay? So we're, we're, we, we're proud of all of you. Um, we're gonna keep pushing you all the way into the last month of the school year because we really want you to know everything that you do this year will contribute to your, your, your ninth grade 
year. And we're just proud of you. And we want to have fun this year, but we also want to make sure you're meeting these expectations and we continue this awesome environment. So we're going to be calling up all classes. All right. We're going to um, let you know who's going to be coming next. So you'll be in queue so we can kind of have a system. Uh, we apologize in advance if we uh, don't pronounce your name right um, because it's not on purpose. And uh, uh, we, we, we greatly appreciate you being here. And uh, again, we're proud of you. OK? So Ms. Wire, any uh, additional information or, that you'd like to convey? Thank you very much, Mr. Clark. I want to thank and congratulate all of you guys for all of your hard work. We are going to start calling up the teachers, and I need you to, the next, the following teacher, to line up behind the one that's collecting the certificates. So, Mr. Edgar, Al I mean, Mr. <laughs> <laughs> Almey, Mr. Poe, Mr. Po, <laughs> if you Almey would Poe. please uh, oh, stand Edgar over Almey here, Poe. and your yeah, students, yeah, your okay. students, well, start well, lining well, up well, after well, Mr. Well, Edgar well, Allen Poe. Yeah, and then it would be Mr. Benham. Mr. Benham, start lining yours while I'm calling out Mr. Almey. So, we're gonna start with the 4.0s and then we follow with the 3.0s. So, Stella, Aver, uh, holding applause. Oh, and hold your applause. That's Thank you. Please hold your applause to the end. Taylor Burke. Caitlin Carolin, Carolyn, sorry, Thomas Acevedo, McCarley Barsenas, Logan Bigham, Aymar Camacho, Hannah Campbell, Mason Campora. Thank you guys. Let's give them a hand. Following that, I have Mr. Benham's class and Ms. Godfrey's class could start lining up right behind. Like I said before, we're going to start with 4.0s. Rebecca Koblet, Isaac Cruz, Sophia Daly, Dahlia Daughtry. 3.5, Lindsay Coffey, Gianna Colicchio, Liam Cooper, Marcus Zekitz, Morgan Diagostino, Anastasia Dambea, and let's give them a pretty Forgive me if I mispronounce your name. Mr. Morelli, you should be lining up right behind. Starting with 4.0, Moxie Edwards, Kaylee Francis, Carly Friend, Anthony Gerardo Gutierrez, Sophia Greenlee, 3.5, Kate. Kate X, X, Luna Garcia, Caitlin Gilchrist, Allison Gilchrist, Micah Garola, Gutierrez, Sarah Gutierrez Cabrera, Brianna Hadlock. Let's give these guys a hand. Starting with 4.0s, we have Alexis Bankuti, Julia Bauer, Donna Cruz, Audrey Cummings, Rocco Donardo, Shankos Helton, Eli Hitt. Peyton Hobda, Lucas 
Ibrahim, 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 Maya Juan, Addison Ketlarski, Alexandra Mikes, Brady Schultz, Tatiana Timmons, um, Isabel, Isabel Stasny, Samantha Taylor, Aiden Johnson, and Charles Wilmot. Thank you.
Cadence McKenna. 3.5s, Mary Hartley, Julie Holland, Carter Kaufman, and Braxton Marie. Thank you.
So hopefully that's a good motivator for you to just try even a little harder next quarter and throughout the year. All right? Ms. Dane, that is such a good point. What, what would prevent you from participating Ooh. in said event? Well, and Ms. Sherman can correct me if I'm wrong, but I'm pretty sure Fs. Later on, when? Starting next quarter? Almost done, Dave. Now, so yeah. So Fs? Second, second, second semester. Second semester, okay? But we're, no Fs this quarter. Yeah. <laughs> Let's just say no more Fs this year. That sounds good. Um, your conduct, so no threes and fours. And no, no, no suspensions. No referrals or suspensions. We'll clarify. Okay, so. The referrals lead to suspension. Make, have good behavior, right? Make good choices. All right, so again, we'd love to have all of you participate in that. We'd love to get, what, 15 buses, right, Ms. Sherman, and have everyone go. Ms. Erickson so, can't wait to go. Yes, Ms. Erickson <laughs> is ready to join you all. Yep. All right, so with that, thank you, teachers. Thank you, students. And uh, we'll go ahead and start dismissing. Those of you toward the back of the room, you got a couple doors you can use, middle, middle doors, and then the front.